hi friends welcome back to angular tutorial in this video we will going to learn about how to create a custom 404 page in your application so from our previous video we got concept of routing how to create route modular wise how to create a group wise and how to send parameter in this video we will going to show you how to use custom 404 page when the url is not exist in your application so if you just go to the app component.html so this is the main component file of our application so here you can see we have created this link using the bootstrap so here you can see the home blog course these three links and we can see inside this so here if you just click on the home it is working that home works if you click on the blog this is calling blog works okay in the same way course for course works basically this text is coming from their particular component so if you just go to one single example so just go to the home home component.html so these are coming from homeworks okay means when you click on the home component i means home url then it's coming suppose i want to create another url like this so here we don't have the contact us or you can say the portfolio so here write portfolio or you can write here contact us okay so and the url is that is contact or you can say anything for portfolio the portfolio section and you can see all the routes are registered into the app routing dot module dot ts so here you can see the components are included and it's using and the home blog and course link are present in this route so if we just click on the portfolio or contact us we are calling the different routes but it these routes are not exist in our application so that time we need the custom 404 page so if we just go to the browser you can click on the portfolio so nothing happened so user needs to see something that is uh, there is any problem or error or anything so i want to see something when the link is actually not present so if you just inspect this element in the console section just go here and if we click on the block that is no error course that is no error but if you go to the portfolio you can see there is the error but these error are not getting from any user so in this section we will call the custom 404 page okay so let's create another component so i want to create a component and i want to show the output from that component so now i want to create a component that is the not found so ng for angular g for generate c for component and my component name is not found okay so write in this way and i want to create the component inside this component folder so i want all the components should be under this components folder so just write components sorry spelling mistake okay so now enter this so basically it will create a component under this components folder so this is the not found page okay and you can see a module.ts is also updated so just open the not found component and if we just go to the app module.ts that is your component is included and it's using inside the declaration section so we not need to change anything in the app module.ts so here we can see the not found page and i want to call this component when the 404 error is occur means when the url is not present that component will works okay so just go to the not found component.html and here write inside the h1 tag suppose here write 404 error and inside the is to tag just write page not found 
okay so this will display when the error is occur means when the page will not found so now call this how we can call this so just go to the app routing module ts and we need to use the wildcard routing so what is the wildcard routing so we will set a pattern that is i will set a path so if that is star star that means and when the ui will not found then the star star will call and along with this it will call the component that is app found component before that we need to use this component so right here import and here write the name so right here from and here slash components slash the full path actually the not found slash not found component and inside this we will write the class name so right here not found component and just include in here so write the component okay so now if we just go to the app component.html file we can see we have no portfolio and contact link but if we just go to this section so here home works blog works and if we just go to the portfolio section it will show the 404 error page not found and same way the for contact us also so this link are not present in your application so you can design for your own but i am showing how to do it so i think it's helpful to you to integrate your custom 404 page so if you want to design anything you can write in the html file that is the component html file so if you write anything it will display in this section okay so that's it so if you have any queries about this video please comment in a below comment section next day we'll going to start the api section so how to get data through api how to view inside the listing so then we will come to the from section and other topics okay so please like and subscribe this channel and don't miss the upcoming video so thanks for watching this video have a good day